Hi, everyone. We're back with another session of Q&A with the man himself, Dr. Hart. Uh, for those that may not know, Dr. Hart is the founder, president, and trainer of trainers at the BioCybernaut Institute. Uh, Dr. Hart, thank you so much for being here again. Always a pleasure, Doug. Oh, I love it. Uh, so, Dr. Hart, this question came in, and the person is saying, essentially, I'm going to summarize it because it was a long write-up. And it says, I'm having trouble letting go of the past. That was the summation of it. How can the BioCybernaut training, or can the BioCybernaut training, I know the answer to this, but how can the BioCybernaut training actually help somebody let go of the past? Well, it's intimately involved with the forgiveness process. Mm -hmm. So um, it's unlikely that the person is having trouble letting go of extraordinarily high pleasurable moments in the past. <laughs> probably not the difficulty. So these are unpleasant situations. Um, grief, sadness, betrayal, um, loss uh, of emotional or material things. And um, the the core of the BioCyberNot Alpha training is a 14-step forgiveness method where you bring in, um, uh, you create a court, uh, could be a traditional court, high wood benches, um, and then three high beings, unimpeachable high beings as your judges. Uh, a common uh, thing is uh, people will choose angels. Um, and uh, But they can be... Uh, Jesus, Krishna, Buddha, uh, Kuan Yin, uh, any of a variety of angels or archangels. Um, and uh, then you bring in somebody who aggrieved you in the past. And uh, you make a charge. I charge you with. <clears throat> and then you go into feeling the pain of that charge. Now, if you can connect with the pain, if it's not too armored uh, and defended against, your alpha will drop. In alpha enhancement, that means that the scores that come up every two minutes will turn white. Uh, you have a minimum of six scores in some trainings, many more, up to 20 or 30 scores in the advanced trainings like alpha five and six. <clears throat> but you want these scores to turn white, a majority of them. And if that happens, then you know you've connected with the pain. And then you make a decision to forgive, that's important. Like, I don't know how, but I'm gonna forgive this person. You look for any lesson that came from that, or maybe even a gift. And so then you walk in the person's shoes and uh, try to see the situation from their perspective. Like one man had, um, it was a small company owner, and one of his trusted employees stole $50,000. And so uh, when he was investigating, he found out that the man's wife had come down with cancer and there was a cure for that cancer and it was a drug and it cost $50,000. And so that made it easier for him to forgive that person. And so in the forgiveness, you literally, um, uh, you go to compassion. You, if you can, you go all the way to love for the person you hug them or embrace them. And this may not all happen on the first day. The trainings are seven days. And with some of the really difficult forgiveness topics, it can take five, six, or even the, to the last day, the seventh day, and before you get to it. But once you have forgiven deeply, it is as though there was no crime, no offense at all. You can remember the incident. It's not. It's not like forgive and forget. No, you can remember. It doesn't. It's not a memory wipe, but the pain of each of those situations is simply gone, and so you can consider it. You can deal with it. You can incorporate it into your future plans, and you don't suffer. The goal of biocybernet is to reduce suffering, and to increase awareness globally. And it's so fascinating, uh, Doctor Hart, because. You know, in, in one of my trainings, there was a, a gentleman, extremely intelligent, successful by most traditional measures, but was on what I would say is kind of his last legs, right? He was almost done with being here with us on this planet, so to speak. And uh, by all, 
I would say, conscious ways. He had believed that he had given forgiveness and done all the protocols that most self-help typical books would say and go through. But the interesting part of that is with the technology and being hooked up to the technology and your brain waves, you can't lie. You can't cheat the system. Uh, so that's, I, I was watching him go through day one, day two, and then day three, as you talked about, he popped and you just saw almost as if he lost 30 pounds of physical weight come off of him. And he had no idea that he hadn't really at the core level forgiven people in his past and past situations, which opened up a pathway and door for him for joy, love, and appreciation that uh, I, I don't think would ever have happened before. Miracles are uh, a stock in trade at Boss Overnight. <laughs> and remember, Arthur C. Clarke, the famous science fiction author, said, any sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from miracles. Yeah, absolutely. Well, it's always interesting to hear your stories because they're so commonplace for you, but for most of us out there, uh, you, you know, there's, they are truly, truly miracles. And I've had the benefit of which, uh, watching them and witnessing miracle after miracle occur. Uh, so, Dr. Hart, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for all that you do. Uh, it's much appreciated. Thank you, Doug. Always a delight to hang out with you. Hi, I'm Tony Robbins. Listen, if you are looking to improve your brain, your psyche, your ability, your emotions, your ability to really maximize your performance, um, and you want to really dig into your brain, my, my dear friend, Dr. Jim Hart and his BioCyberNet program is extraordinary. I've been through it myself. My wife, Sage, has. Members of my family have. And we found it to be truly extraordinary. But it is not for the faint at heart. Unless you're dead serious about really taking things to the next level, don't bother. We went through the Alpha program designed to maximize your ability to have create Alpha waves. And it was challenging and it was incredibly rewarding. And I'd recommend it to anybody serious about improving the quality of their lives or including the quality of their family lives as well. So check out Cybernaut, check out Dr. Jim Hart. And uh, if you do, I think you'll be really, really pleased. And the entire time you are learning to think and how you think the, these electrodes create sounds. And you learn how to put yourself in the zone of alpha. But it's a bitch. It's horrible. I wouldn't recommend it to anybody that wants easy experiences, but I'd recommend it to anybody that wants to grow immensely. And by the, and the first day, I'm like, who do I got to shoot to get out of this thing? Oh, it's me. I'm the one that did this shit. <laughs> right? But by the end of the week, all three of us were able to go into this state of alpha. And if you're familiar with alpha, the best way I can describe alpha is there's no problem that can't be solved in alpha. Because every problem that we have was created by us. Thank you for being here and absorbing this information about the science of brainwaves and about the stories of people whose lives have been beneficially altered, improved by doing brainwave training at BioCyberNet. And now I'm reaching out to you to invite you to come and be a part of the BioCyberNet adventure. BioCybernauts are to inner space what astronauts are to outer space. So come and adventure with us. And if you'd like to leave a comment on the videos, you can do that. Or there's a link you can click if you'd like to learn more. We welcome you to BioCybernaut.